Hi Climate Kids, Audrey here, and today we're going to be learning how to make origami coyotes and then talking about the role of coyotes and other large animals in our ecosystems, especially in the face of climate change. Let's get started. All right, so what you'll need for this project is a piece of square paper and a pen. I painted this to look like a coyote's fur, but you can use whatever kind of paper that you want. So first start by flipping it over and creasing it down the middle. Next, turn and fold diagonally. Next, you're going to take the bottom corners and fold to meet the center line. Next, pick it up and fold in half diagonally. So next, you're gonna take this corner right here and fold it up from the edge. This middle part can then be opened and flattened to make your coyote's face. Next, all you have to do is take this corner and fold it over flat to make his tail. And you're all done. You can decorate it with a face. Add some fluffiness to its ears. And you've got yourself an adorable little coyote. Coyotes, like the one that we made today, as well as other large animals like bobcats and mountain lions, play a really important role as predators in the ecosystem. However, as drought happens and climate gets warmer, it becomes harder for them to find the resources that they need far away from humans. As this starts to happen, you might see more conflict between humans and animals as the animals like coyotes need to move closer into your neighborhoods to find water and food. Keeping a connected landscape with plenty of room for these animals to move around is an important part of a healthy ecosystem and an important part of resilience as the climate continues to change. Thank you.